would do one of these favourite videos. I have loads of favourites at the moment and I thought it would be cool to share with you. So my first favourite is my brand new chilli bottle. Oh, we're such good friends. Today we went swimming together and I took her into um, the steam room with me and yes, my water was still chilly. This is such an extravagance I would never have allowed myself to purchase but I got it as a lovely gift from a really nice friend of mine. Um, yeah, so I love it. It's I've been drinking loads more water because I want to spend time with it <laughs> and it does keep my water nice and chilly and I quite like to have a water bottle beside my bed because the kids quite often want to have a drink of water all of a sudden when they see water next to your bed and it always ends up spilt but it's nice and safe in my chilli bottle. Definite, definite current favourite. My second favourite, something I have already shown you as well, but I really, really love it. Um, and it is my fancy mask that I got from Kyla Tony at Guy. It's actually called Label.M Professional Hair Care Intensive Mask. Um, deep conditioning for hair healing and I so think it works. I know that we found the root of my problem with my heat damage situation with my hair dryer. Um, but I really think that this has given me a helping hand and I love it. It smells lovely and I don't think it was too, too expensive. I have the figure 12 pounds, 12 or 16 in my hand, but it's a big pot um, where you can just about see the bottom there. It's really thick. It's down to about there now because um, I was laying it on that first. Oh, it smells amazing. So now I just use like a fingertip um, every other day or two, two times a week really because um, my hair is so much better, so soft, I'm always touching it because <laughs> look it moves, it was it stopped moving for ages, it was just so brittle but now it's sorted and partially I feel down to this mask um, so yeah I totally recommend it if you're struggling with your hair, it's great. Um, another favourite of mine, these all seem to be quite health and beauty-ish but um, constant favourite, I've used this for about Mm, two two years or one cc cream i've got i've got good skin i'll say it i've got good skin and i don't like foundations that cover my skin i like to still see my skin and um, because it's a good feature of mine if i was slim maybe i'd show off my body and <laughs> um, so i think it is quite well quite expensive for me for a foundation especially if i really wear foundation but it's so good and it lasts me for ages because I just put a wee tiny bit on um, and I love it. I just really really like it. It feels good on my skin, it goes on really well. It doesn't feel caked or clarted or... I just really like it. So yeah, there's my... and my uh, second favourite Arbonne product is the bronzer. I saved money by not using this for ages. I really, really missed it. Same with the CC cream. I tried to do without it and then one day I was feeling sad and I got it for myself for a treat. Um, I really love both of these. Um, basically this and any cheap mascara and I am happy and sorted for the day. Um, if I am in a makeup wearing mood that day. Yeah, I really love this. It's got such a nice colour um, and I just feel like it totally lifts me when I'm usually white and flat and knackered from being up with the children and stuff, so massive favourite of mine. Um, uh, another uplifting favourite of mine is this at the moment. It's called Cheer and it's a blend by doTERRA. You know I like my essential oils. So I love this for diffusing and it's um, because we're heading into the winter season it's I'm smelling like spicy, orangey, cinnamony, cheery, almost Christmassy but not quite. Um, I'm guessing this is my version of pumpkin spice. It's lovely and it just makes me so happy. I just want to smell it and put the fire on. I haven't got a fire in this house but I cannot wait till we get into the next house that we're staying in, get the open fire back on and some of this diffusing. Mm -hmm. Christmas is coming. Another health and beauty favourite. Obviously I've been working loads on my hair lately because I was having trouble with it um, and my mum gave me this magical stuff and it's lovely. 
It's Botanical Shine Nourishing Hair Oil, All Hair Types by Liz Earl. I do love Liz Earl, I can't afford it, but um, my mum uses it, so get, this was a free product that she got for buying hundreds of other stuff, I think, I don't know. Um, but it's too, she's got really thin hair and it's too much for her, she doesn't really use it. So she's passed it to me and I am delighted because I do use a daily hair oil. Um, and it's lovely, I really enjoy it, it's nice got quite it's not a nice nice smell I smell like almost sunflower oil blend of Kalari melon oil coconut oil radish seed oil botanical shine nourishing hair oil conditions and smooth oh, I don't know what I'm smelling maybe it's really quite fragrance free actually um, but it's really light and always nice to give your hair a little helping hand so yeah I like it it doesn't make it feel greasy or weighed down and you can put it on wet hair or as I'm doing now dry hair and it's good and obviously it's going to last for ages because you just use a pump so I think that's how much my mum's used I've only used it a few times but I'm really liking it so that's another current favourite especially because it was another gift I love getting gifts such a spoiled monkey at the moment, um, uh, so that's good. Uh, long time favourite, I've been using this stuff for about seven years and it is Zephora. I know it's super super popular now and everybody loves it. Um, I first used it when I moved out to the country and it was in all the old fashioned shops. You, couldn't, you didn't used to really get this in like Tesco and stuff as much. Um, but you do now and I love it. So I bulk buy pink grapefruit in Home Bargain every time I see it because it is my absolute favourite. Oh, I just love it. It makes me, it just makes, it, it smells really fresh and nice to me and I love my whole kitchen and house. I do the floors and everything um, in it and everything smells of just really fresh and clean and summery. I love it. I'm not so keen on all the heavy floral scents I have to say. Um, the first one I tried was Bouquet and I I didn't like it so much but then I think I got fresh linen and it was better so I, but I like the citrusy lemony this is my favorite pink grapefruit is my favorite but if I didn't get this I would probably go for linen or um, I think there's a citrusy limey orange one I think yeah. love it now we'll loads of it another current favorite um all-time favorite life-saving favorite of mine is Apple TV <laughs> We bought this uh, maybe two, three years ago in order to watch a uh, Game of Thrones <laughs> episode that we were we were up to but we couldn't get so we had to buy up through Apple TV and we just love Apple TV. We um, have been using it in the mornings at five when the children get up um, to just kind of try and get a little bit more sleep. Um, my mum has actually enjoyed using it since we moved in here. Um, I think she's desperate to now get one when we leave and it just is great. You can watch YouTube and Netflix and um, you can buy like friend films on this which is great um, if, if you don't want to buy a DVD or you just think oh, I'd like to watch it. It's like a cheap way of going to the cinema at home. Just Oh I really I love it. There's so much you can do in it. Um, I've been playing the kids music on it when we have some inside discos just to try and stop crazy behaviour, we sometimes randomly just drop everything and have a disco. Um, Apple TV, it's awesome. Another favourite of mine, which I don't have here, but I will put a picture in for, is my Kilner jar. <laughs> sangria this morning we're having paella tonight and I just love it I love filling it full of well generally just sangria I may try mold wine I don't know but um it's so great even I've, in the summer I used it for the children with like a fruit punch or even just juice or water with fruit in it or something it's really really good and the kids love the wee tap um, and so do I so I love my culinary jar and that was just it was under 20 pounds and it was from the range um, I think it was on sale, I want to say 12, it was decent and I've used it loads and I just love it. Um, and my final favourite at the moment is our, uh, our, my new van trainers. I bought 
these for myself um, when I was doing the um, Charlie House fashion show. I had my skirt and leather jacket, t-shirt combo, and I was like, I want to get some nice trainers, I need them anyway. So I got myself these to match my outfit, but they've got a wee, they're like really pale soft grey with a rose gold stripe through it, and I just love them, they're really nice, and I wear them all the time. They seem to be wearing quite well, they're comfy. I always love the look of Converse trainers, they just don't suit my feet, they're too narrow and long, and they actually hurt my feet. Vans are a bit wider. Um, I used to always wear either Vans or DCs, and I always find that Vans um, lasted way better than DCs and were more comfortable. So I'm going back to them and I'm really loving them. I feel a bit cool. <laughs> uh, mm, I know that's not true, but I can pretend. Thanks for watching my video and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know about your favourites. What's your favourite? Do you have a chilli bottle? What colour is your chilli bottle? Do you love your chilli bottle?